Hello everybody, it's Benny D here uh, with the Valiant Victories uh, show. Yeah, oh, are you ready? Are you ready? Aha, uh -huh. I know I, ooh, I'm definitely ready. I brought uh, here uh, Archer and Armstrong Forever number one. Yeah, this will be our first review. Uh, so I don't know how to review a comic, so I'm just going to talk. I'll talk a little bit about it. Uh, can you, t If you haven't noticed, the theme is I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just talking, and hopefully somebody enjoys it. So they, here, I enjoy it already. So here we go. So Archer and Armstrong forever. Uh, oh, I love Archer and Armstrong. Uh, what I got, uh, I'll probably go into it a little bit uh, later. My uh, introduction to Valiant Comics was through Delinquents. If you remember that one, it was with Archer and Armstrong and Quantum and Woody. Oh my goodness, I read that. And then I said, ooh, I like, uh, ooh, I like this Armstrong guy. I went back and uh, started at the beginning with Archer and Armstrong there. And, and then I had to get everything because that's the way I am. So there we go. So I love Archer and Armstrong. And uh, that's a big part of why I wanted to do this, uh, this show because I, I love this comic and I wanted to talk more about it. So here we go. Let me see. Um, you ready for uh, uh, some butchering of names? Here we go. If anybody knows how to pronounce names and I'm not doing it right, please let me know. Uh, uh, write in to valiantvictories at gmail.com or valiantvictory on Twitter. I'll see if I uh, remember to check any of that. So here we go. So this is the uh, the comic. It's uh, The writer is Steve Fox. Uh, art by Marcio. Yeah, there we go. Marcio Fiorito. Uh, colorist, uh, ooh, this part, I do, I'm, ooh, I'm going to try my best. Uh, Alex Guimaraes, I'm trying. Uh, letter, Hassan Osman Alao. There we go. I'm, ooh, that's definitely, definitely said that one, right? Uh, yes, yeah, so there we go. And then a whole lot of other folks. I won't go through the, that whole list. But uh, here we go. So here's the book. It opens up. Ooh, it opens up in a great way. Archer's on the phone with Faith. Oh, you remember that they are dating. Oh, so we're starting off like connecting things together. So that's a good way to start. Uh, we got uh, uh, Armstrong there pulling off his pants. That's a good way to start too. <laughs> so they're uh, they're going there, and uh, oh, we get some new villains. Ooh, new villains. And ooh, another thing that I really liked uh, from uh, Fred Van Lente's run, it's got uh, it, it's breaking down like all the moves. So I liked I liked that. And it, man, this uh, it really made me think of the the old series. There we go. So there's some action there going on, some kicking in the face there. That was good. And then uh, it turns out the the main crux of this, uh, uh, Armstrong whoop, loses an ear. So there we go. And we got a, a, our other villain there, that guy. Oh, what was his name? Uh, the Eccentric, I think. There we go. So uh, uh, Armstrong wakes up. He realizes, wait a minute, that should have grown back by now, but it didn't. Um, and then, oh, look, the boon. Ah, oh, they remembered all that stuff they're talking about, all the stuff at the very beginning. Ah, it's continuity. Oh, I love continuity. There we go. Oh, and Archer's uh, drinking. He does, he does that a lot. There we go. There's some more action there. Flipping, flipping, flipping. Ooh, more action. There's a lot of action. A lot of comedy, too. It's a good balance of all that. Oh, there we go. They're beating up some folks trying to get some information about that ear. And then, ooh, there's there's the maw. Ooh, there we go. Oh, we're going to learn more about the maw coming up, too. There we go. But uh, uh, Archer, he realizes he needs to help Armstrong, because he's worried that Armstrong is not immortal anymore. So he wants to get to the bottom of that. And then, uh, <gasps> look, a vine alien. There we go. Ah, yes, some more continuity. Isn't that great? Oh, it's good to have continuity. And then we realize, uh-oh, they got uh, some plans to capture uh, Armstrong. So there we go. And then <gasps> a little teaser for the next issue. Look at that. Uh, oh, there we go. And brush those teeth. So there we go. So that was Archer and Armstrong Forever, number one. Um, my thoughts, I thought the writing was really solid. Lots of uh, lots of action and uh, lots of comedy. And the thing you're going to hear me say a lot that I like, continuity. Oh, I love it when there's continuity. Because I've... I've been reading all along. I wanna, I wanna to connect. Don't, uh, don't start. You know, yeah. If you're a new reader, yeah, you gotta, know, you know, dip your toe and figure it out. But then go back, figure it out. 
you know. But if you are a new reader, I think you would pick up what's going on uh, really easy. Uh, very good characterization, we got that. Uh, in terms of the art, I uh, really enjoyed it. Yeah, very uh, uh, expressive faces, very good action. Uh, coloring, very uh, uh, bright. It seems to uh, uh, complement the art very well. And um, uh, the lettering, uh, Hassan, I'm just going to go with Hassan so I don't uh, uh, ruin the, the end, the last name there. Uh, some, it seems like with uh, lettering, there's kind of two schools of thought. You either want it to kind of uh, don't notice it at all, or uh, I think in Hassan's case, I do notice it, but it enhances uh, it, it, he uses a lot of colors in uh, in the lettering. Uh, uses a lot of fun. Oh, let me see. I gotta find some more fun stuff. But uh, yeah, he. Uh, I can tell that it's him, but uh, it doesn't pull me out. It uh, it's it's really part of the art, part of the story. It really uh, it enhances everything. So there we go. So uh, uh, I'm not gonna do like a number rating or anything. Uh, you really need to go check this series out. It's great. Uh, so great start, great start, great start. I did read number two already, so maybe we'll uh, talk a little bit about number two coming up. But uh, yeah, share your thoughts with me at uh, valiantvictories at gmail.com or valiantvictory on Twitter. Uh, you probably leave a comment. Uh, uh, I'm very sensitive, so don't hurt my feelings. Don't uh, don't be mean to me. Don't no, no trolling. This is about being positive. It's the victories, victories. So uh, uh, so yeah, the, 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 don't hate, don't hate. Love, love y'all. All right. So uh, thanks for joining me. I, ooh, if you made it this long, I don't know why. But anyway, thanks for coming along and sharing some valiant victories with me. I'll talk to you later. Bye.